what's up guys <laughs> back at you live with another face mask on and this is the same one from the previous video the um saint ives oatmeal soothing face mask i just had to do a face mask i need to detox and just calm down and just whatever so originally i was supposed to get my hair done today today is december 4th sorry i have not like introduced actually it's december 5th that's how far behind I am in life. So today's December 5th. I woke up this morning super late. I was supposed to have a 10 a.m. hair appointment. And because I got off work at close to 6 a.m. Or went to bed at close to 6 a.m. By the time I got home, it was like 5.30-ish. Um, I legit was so tired. I set two alarms because I needed to take down my hair. If you know, I had previously spring twists and I love them. I had them in for almost a month and um, it was just time to refresh my hair, definitely cleanse my scalp and my hair and do a deep conditioning, which is what I'm doing right now. Um, so I was ready to like do a new style and I just did not wake up in time. I should have actually took down my hair yesterday and then like prepped it for today, but I don't know time got away from me yesterday i was kind of being a little more lazy and i just was very tired so i thought that i could just wake up take a little nap basically wake up and go get my hair done but that was not the case so i'm mad at myself because i'm starting the day off all wrong but it would take like legit only like a few minutes like maybe 45 to an hour no it took me three hours to take down my hair that being said around two o'clock i realized like mm, this is not gonna happen like so um i let her know and we rescheduled so i'm gonna get my hair done on friday i'm super excited so ended up taking my hair down by around 2 30 ish i washed it and now i'm deep conditioning my hair um i felt like a new scalp because like i haven't been able to like fully give my scalp a wash and a scrub and like deep condition my hair and stuff like that which I tend to do on like a weekly basis that is what's going on with my hair so that was like a bummer this morning then I was like you know what I'm gonna be productive I'll go to the laundromat now typically I go to the laundromat which is maybe five or six blocks away from my apartment and I don't mind going to the laundromat i mean i'll just take an uber and go or whatever but i do have a laundry facility within my building it is like an awkward way that you have to go like outside and go down these stairs and i typically live well i live on like the third floor which can be very tiring if you're going up and down up and down you know with loads of laundry and all that stuff so i was like you know what we're gonna just suck it up we're gonna go around this corner we're gonna go and just use the laundry facility within my building and i'm just gonna whatever washing there's literally only three washing machines three dryers so which would also mean that they're probably taken because who, whose dog is this I think this is my neighbor's dog you know cowboy Aww. I'm gonna let you out oh get down there and there's this freaking dog down there blew my entire being like I was just like why why is this dog here why is this dog guarding the laundry area like what is going on so and I know that dog that dog literally is my next door neighbor my floor next door neighbor's dog and he was locked in there for some reason just a whole fiasco so I ended up coming back upstairs with my laundry so that didn't get done today either um <laughs> 
So I was like, you know, if I don't get my hair, because I was thinking like, man, I really need to do laundry, but like I will sacrifice it to get my hair done. Of course, you know, time is money, whatever. What can you do? And so since, since I missed out on my appointment for getting my hair done, I thought like, I'll just go ahead and do laundry, clean up my apartment. Now I'm not even motivated to clean up legit. Like I have a few hours before I have to be at work. So I just am like, whatever, I'm going to just get into a Zen moment. I think I'm going to make myself some tea and just try to like redirect my energy and not be so disappointed in things that are out of my control. Um, and also things that have been rescheduled to happen because there's no need to like waste energy on spilled milk, water under the bridge. Let's move forward. What can we do? So I'm just like, you know what? who has time to clean i'm gonna sit and chill so right now i'm actually about to watch a few vlogs so as you guys know like i said all of my entertainment basically is surrounded around watching youtube videos i absolutely love watching youtube videos and i don't i don't have a tv which i do plan on getting hopefully within this vlogmas um we can go shopping for some electronics and stuff like that but i'm kind of bummed so I am going to watch a few of my favorite YouTubers, um, watch their Vlogmas um, season series, and I'm going to, I also, the damn dog is in the apartment next door now. He's in his apartment where he should have been all along barking. Ugh, so annoyed. Literally, this is the guy next door. I'm so annoyed. Um, no, I'm not annoyed. I'm not, <laughs> we're not annoyed. <laughs> um, we love everyone. <laughs> this inside joke yes um anyway so this face mask is making my teeth look like they're not um white enough they aren't that do need to get a whitening anyway so i am just going to chill out for the next few hours i probably will take you guys with me when i go to work um, and film because I do work downtown Chicago so um, the lights and everything is going to be really cute it's dark already so I already know the lights are on in downtown Chicago uh, all right so my food came I don't know if I told y'all but I ordered some stuff from Grubhub because I just can't first of all like I said all I've been doing is sleeping basically and going to work and between those two times I rarely want to leave the house to do any errands. I did get some stuff from Grubhub and I actually got um, some food from what? Great Steak Potato. You guys know about that restaurant, uh, Great Steak. Um, and they have like really good like Philly cheese steak sandwiches and stuff like that. So I ended up getting one of those and I got something called Mexican fries, which I never had and didn't even know that they had. And then I also got like some drinks and stuff too. So got to eat that while I go ahead and watch the vlogs like I was saying earlier um first of all I asked for a tropical punch drink because I don't drink pop I'm so annoyed now because I don't drink pop like and this is caffeine free so it doesn't even it's not even gonna benefit me so I'm gonna take this to work and give it to somebody because I don't drink pop I did however order a Pepsi but I also ordered the tropical drink the tropical drink is for now supposed to be tropical punch and the Pepsi I was gonna take to work to like drink at work if I get tired and stuff because it obviously has caffeine <sighs> just sometimes you just can't get good service you know can't get it and even if like they didn't have the tropical punch they should have gave me something else that's not carbonated or you know it's not a pop lemonade iced tea something i don't know <sighs> anyway so i am still making my tea right now um i am actually the one i'm drinking today is from bigelow um i don't know if i've shared i share it on my insta stories um my like tea craze like i love teas and this is like one of my absolute favorite teas it's from bigelow it's called peach patch no perfect peach <laughs> what did i just read okay i had to take off that mask because it was getting like very stiff but this is turning into a rant video i am so sorry but i must say i ordered something called the mexican fries and they legit are tater tots i think that's impossible i feel like i got the wrong order i'm just like what so you get my drink wrong and then you just give me tater tots since when is a tater tot a mexican fry what <sighs> uncle Juan. <Huang. laughs> 
I want to call and complain. Like, something right. Maybe we want to take y'all to an expensive, like, okay, I'll be ready. I'll be ready. Where are we going? Oh. <laughs>